belongs to us. If it's to be sold to anyone, it needs to be sold to us, the Bahamian people. And we are adamant with this. We are not going to back down. Hubert Ingram does not own BTC, and we will not let him sell our things. We want it, we can pay for it, we can run it. The Bahamians must have a chance in the Bahamas. If Hubert Ingram does not believe the Bahamians are incompetent of anything, competent to do anything, if he believes we are incompetent, then he should set the example and be the first one to resign and let somebody who is competent run this country. The Prime Minister said that you are a minority, minority person to oppose this sale. What do you say about that? Well, the Prime Minister has been wrong before, he's wrong now. And I'm sure he won't be around much longer. Uh, we're going to get rid of him because we must get rid of him. The biggest problem in this farmers, the biggest threat to democracy in this farmers, the biggest threat to, to national security in this farmers is Hubert Alexander Ingram. He has to go. A number of persons describe him as a dictator. What do you think about that? Well, I wouldn't describe him as a dictator, right? Because some dictators are good for their countries. He is an awful dictator. He is destroying this country. He is setting us back hundreds of years. The things that he is doing, is, is uh, they can be described best as uh, treasonous. The Germans said that the Bohemian people elect him to do what he's doing, and he's going to do it in spite of you all. The Bohemian people elected uh, his party. We do not elect him. And the other part is, we do not elect him to do this. And we're demonstrating this. If he thinks that we elected him to do this, tell him put it to a referendum so we can show what we want. This is a democracy, put it to a referendum. It's a very important thing. There is nothing, there is nothing in all of this that explains what is going on with BTC except a deal. Somebody is making a deal at our expense. But the Prime Minister already said there will be no more referendum under this watch, this particular, this particular term. Well, we are having a referendum right now because we will not allow him to sell BTC. And if cable and wireless believe that they bought BTC, they can be assured that if the National Development Party comes to a position of influence in this country, our prime thrust will be to take BTC back. We will take it back. And they will not be happy at the way we're going to take it back. So we do not want cable and wireless in this country. They are not welcome. Their people are not welcome. If they come here as tourists, we will smile with them and treat them nicely. But we do not want their people in this country. We don't know them. We don't like them. We have no desire to know them in that capacity. We want them to understand clearly they are unwelcome in the Bahamas. Patrick Bow, NDP candidate. Thank you.